Hello everyone, this is Bigowski. And this is JTB. And this is chapter 4 of my Ninja Guide Master Collection Sigma, making the end of chapter Master Ninja Ranking. Now, this chapter, the time limit is very short, and so you really want to maximize your saves depending on how good your movement is. My movement is bad, so I probably saved a little bit more than maybe somebody like JTB would. But on this fight right here, I mean, even something as simple as learning your positioning right here, trying to figure out how you want to jump down. You know, there's, you know, five or 10 seconds wasted. And see, I jumped a little bit too far. But I think here you can get two UTs, but I was fine with three ETs. Mm -hmm. You know, again, it's not a maximum karma run. So, but go back up there and watch this, watch. Did you see how he rolled uphill? Yeah, he yeah, you got the you got the rolling downhill animation, but he he did it up the hill. That that's a gif right there. <laughs> that's, that's funny. But here, uh, so you want to fight uh, you want to make those guys spawn so you can kill this guy. And now if he goes down to like the second step as it starts to go down, I don't think the essence drags. So you just got to be careful with that. And here, I think I get a little unlucky that I killed yeah. I mean, but I was able to at least. You could have, get yeah, you could have UT'd him, though. Like, you yeah. would have had time, yeah. But again, those are for the maximum scores, and we're not doing that. We're giving peace of mind here. And here's another one, too. I could probably have dropped a smoke bomb, and then, because you can get two UT or three UTs here, or you could kill the barrels. Yeah. But I knew the chapter time, or destroy the barrels, not kill them. But I knew the chapter time was short. So saving me an extra 10 seconds or 12 seconds. And this is what I was talking about in chapter three, just charge up the ET. And then that way you don't take damage and destroy the barrels. But you know, that's just a little bit of time saved. Yeah. And uh, again, if your movement isn't good, then I think uh, getting a few ETs versus UTs and, and spending the extra time running around is uh is crucial to again keep your sanity because we're, we're just going for the master ninja ranking we're not going for the max points and there's my great movement again i don't know why i would drop a smoke bomb there but i really dislike those smoke bombs they, aren't cheap man you know just yeah throwing away money well since i've got so much money you know it's no object <laughs> it's or whatever. Sigma, yeah you know that, <laughs> it's like money's no object in this game now i do this a little bit differently here um I let Ryu target him automatically and listen for three hits. And then once he's been hit three times, and I'm surprised Ryu nailed that. I, I can't believe he nailed it over, over the thing. He had his to bix that morning, yeah. Yeah. But I like, because if I go straight into the camera, that's when the timer's going to start. And I'm so bad with the bow, as you'll see right here in this camera angle. I still got to get used to that. And I don't even see the rat. I just kind of blindly shoot. <laughs> and then I'm like, oh, I heard it. Okay, well, how, how do I get out of the camera again? Okay, wait a minute. So I should have dropped it. Uh, I didn't have my smoke bomb there, so that kind of messed me up. That's but, just style points there. See, so yeah, like yeah. there, you could have actually scooped that guy up for an ET. Yeah. Then you can't do that in black. Uh, that's kind of Total like, waste mean, of time right here. I'm sorry. Total waste <laughs> of time. Do not do this. Do not get the life of the gods going across the room, or life of the thousand gods going across the yeah. Room. Okay. Sorry about that. No, I was gonna say uh, that's a that's one of the weird changes because uh, I'd have to go back and check, but off the top of my head, I don't think you can do that in NGO four, can you? You can't relaunch people that are killed with a dragon sword UT. Right. They just you know they just dissolve instantly. Whereas say in, in Sigma you can. Um. So in, in, oh, hold in on real quick. Here's another very very bad because I'm not far to the left. Oh, I don't yeah, trigger the scene. Yeah. And then I'm like, oh crap, well let me start over. It's like, no, well you know what, let me just kind of see what happens here. I'm used to it while you see that. Yeah, I mean, so, so I got that. And then, you know, I got another UT here. And I'm going to get another UT. But again, just... Uh, nah, you're fine. Yeah. Not the best. But again, this is kind of, let me see how this works out. I'm still kind of testing save strategies. It's like, okay, well let me go up and try this because I do want the second spirit of the devils right up here to have that extra nimpo slots and then i you know i just really i mean look how lucky i get 
I'm like, wow, that worked out. I can't believe that worked out. Well, you know what? Let me just chain this up here too. Yeah. But I'm going to use the, the Nimpo trick, and this is actually a very, and I don't want to say it's a trick, but it's a method of not having to worry about charging. You see, Nimpo, that kills him. The other Nimpo kills him. I have Essence to ET, and then Ford Y or UT, this last guy. And that Nimpo is really good for that. It is. I can't believe you got a blue there, honestly. Blues, well, blues in general just seem so much rarer in Sigma. Like or on even on enemies that like usually drop blues, it, you seem to get way less blue drops in Sigma. Right. So now I'm going to go back and save. So you know, notice the extra time. Uh, I could have maybe restarted. I just want to see how it played out. And even though the karma side of Alan is not happy with it the let's just go through and get the ranking and get you know get a decent score yeah i mean it, it's perfectly fine and again you can target those bats just like i could have targeted them with maramasa or i mean instead of going to maramasa i could have not the bats the uh, the rats the rats and i knew uh, what you meant <laughs> yeah 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 i'm sorry but but with my bow skills i'm just going to be wasting time so using that maramasa trick is uh you know, helps you start out that fight with a UT. I, I would have gotten a U, or I would have gotten a UT, and you could possibly get four UTs, but that's a little too much here. So, I tried this route a, a couple of times, and I really just uh, preferred this. You know, yeah. again, I could have dropped a smoke bomb. Now, this is how it's supposed to work, right there. Ah, there we go. Uh, one yeah. thing I really did like in Sigma is that they took away those goddamn pillars in this in this arena. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, the ninjas just—they really confuse the ninjas in that fight. Like sometimes they just get stuck behind them and they just <clears> run <throat> into them forever. Uh, and the, so the, the, them taking those out—that oh, that was such a nice change from black to sigma. Right now, you could go up to where the next fight is that I'm going to show, and there's a like a little barrier that you could charge your lunar with and UT in there. Mm -hmm. But I just wanted to make sure that I got my kills and just did this the easiest way possible because if you release too early and uh whiff and then they drop down you got to kind of start all the fights over again yeah so uh, maybe as a time saver maybe not you know go out and kill those guys but i also wanted to pick up that scarab i mean i could pick it up later on see how i can't even run straight there's that's i'm not ever going to be in a speed run i can't that's even why that's straight. why you roll jump running's hard man I would, yeah, I would somehow find a way to jump off or something like that. It would be, you, know, you can't jump off there. Oh yeah, watch Big Al play. You know, we'll see what happens. But so now I'm going to go and save again. Here I'm not going to look at the guys. And uh, this pattern again, you know, works good for me. Maybe there's an optimal pattern to that. And of course, look at all my extra. I put this, in the Nimpo I didn't need to put in there. Yeah, but I mean, that save statue is a godsend in this chapter. Chapter 4, like chapter 4 normal is probably one of the hardest chapters on a normal karma run in black. Uh, but that extra save statue in Sigma is so helpful. Well, the the, the reason is, once, it, once you unlock that room and go in here, these ninjas spawn. And mm -hmm. whereas in black, uh, they don't spawn until you buy something from Maramasa. And yeah. then also, if you run down to the area, the save statue is not there until after you fight the motorcycle guys. Yep. So, <clears throat> so now I'm going to Maramasa to, to kind of buy a lot of stuff. Again, no, no, I'm doing the other. Okay, I got one more fight to yeah, do. Yeah, you got the, the ninja <clears throat> yeah. fight. And then I'll, I'll do the Mar That's the reason I did this pattern first. Or, the, you know, the, the ninjas first, then this. Instead of doing this, go to Miramasa, and then do the other three sets of ninjas. Because here I have more money. I do love the uh, like the, the, the new Fiend Sealer animations in Sigma. You know, when you stab them, and like, they grab their back and like roll over. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, ah, like, I do love... It's, it's great when you, uh, when you Fiend Sealer the ninjas, they just grab their crotch. Like, even if you don't... <laughs> like, they, they just grab their crotch, like, oh, <laughs> just die. So, so you could get three UTs out of that fight with little extra movement. For some reason, I I drop a smoke bomb and jump away. But if the enemies aren't that close to you, you don't have to to do that. But look at me. I mean, I'm going to spend all my money here. Yeah, you might as well. 
yeah and uh i don't think i don't think i upgraded my wooden sword i could have oh look at my my essence seven 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 yeah, did you upgrade the two, uh, luna two, there? but huh did you upgrade the luna there no I, i'm not okay. going to upgrade the lunar in this oh, okay you know i mean i i could but i also want to you know kind of get a, a maybe a better score than what this playthrough is really kind of meant for because see that's still the karma side of me but i'm still not going all out yeah and let me tell you what one time when i came through here i mean they just nailed me i mean it was like i felt like i was in ninja gaiden 2. <laughs> you know how, how brutal all of those words and this is kind of a crapshoot right here on what's going to happen mm -hmm. you could go over to where the blue uh wall is and uh you know, maybe charge right there, but I, you know, I've been shot so many times there. I tried it on the steps of Hans Bar. I've had it where the guys get stuck down in the, the alleyway. And one thing you don't want to release too early here, but I think dropping the smoke bomb is, uh, you know, helps out a lot. And then if for some reason, you know, you, you need an extra save point or whatever, just nympho them both. Yeah, you yeah, know. you can do because you can still go to the uh, you know like the hands bar machine to refill your nipo. Right. Uh, the the chapter that. doesn't end until you uh, pick up the key. Yeah, I, I ran back for some reason. I have no idea why I ran back. You I know, love it when you do like... that sometimes and Ryu's just holding the Luna while he's running. <laughs> yeah, you know, he's just holding <laughs> the Luna like in that animation. It looks so it looks so wonky when he does that. Well, this right here is. Uh... A little time waster and of course my bad jumps right here and and you'll see the reason i keep pointing out all these little extra wasted moves but I, I recommend whatever you do do not pick up the key until you save because you don't want to start the next chapter the timer start before you even know it which happened to me at first and then you know it not be a timed fight if you reload mm -hmm. so always save before you pick up this lily key i mean you don't have to but i I really recommend it right there. So I didn't write this in, uh, or I'm gonna, I'll add it in a little bit later on. I forgot to put my title in, but the chapter time is 12 minutes. And I cut it close and you'll see. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very. Or 11.59, it's 11.59. So I made yeah. it by two seconds. So all those extra moves going to pick up the chucks that, uh, extra running around after i you know got the essence to spawn for miramasa those bad jumps after i i picked up the uh the nympho and again if you don't want to run up top and also here's something else so i might play with that on in the next uh ryu chapter i haven't really decided yet but it's part I of the game i think that's the one that boosts health or maybe yeah something yeah and uh but but anyway so I can all the mistakes that I made, especially on the movement ones. If people can clean that up, they they might have a chance to get an extra save in there somewhere if they want to. But working on the bow, there is a way to shoot the the captain guy without looking at him at all. The the trusted no look attack. As long as you don't center the camera on him, the timer won't spa, uh, start. But kill him, and then you can wall run across and get a UT on the guy you know on the other side or you could actually run past that the the part with the bow as long as they don't look at you and then go down and save yeah you, you know there so as long as you don't look at them because if the timer starts and you save and especially if you save over another save it's not going to be a timed fight and that's going to be losing out some points you'll get the kills for the chapter but you know you're missing out on you know, 20,000 points roughly. And uh, who knows, that could be what it takes to get your Master Ninja ranking versus, what's the lower one, Greater Ninja? I, I, think? Think. I think it's Master, Head, Greater, Lesser, Ninja Dog, I think. Oh, well, whatever it is, it's not Master. <laughs> you know, <laughs> yeah. and that's, what, that's what we're focusing on <laughs> right now. But I think uh, I also show you don't have to play perfect either in order to do it too so finding that balance getting used to the game getting used to especially the bow like i said i've made a a save for my chapter two so i can go and practice that because i'm really worried about 
later on. As you can see by some of my bow use, it's not the, uh, the greatest in the world. I've always said I suck with the bow. Well, I really suck with the bow in this version of Sigma. So it's, uh, it's time to practice that one, Bigowski. Definitely you know. takes some getting used to, yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know, I admire Godfather and you who can just switch back and forth, you know, like it's no problem at all. But, you know, for the folder, uh, for the elder generation of Ninja Gaiden players, it's, uh, it takes a little bit to get used to. Like I said, I'm still pressing the Borderlands menu for the start. Or, you know, that's what I think it is. And I keep bringing up the map, so... Any uh any last things? I know we I kind of interrupted you a couple times, but that was because I wanted to you know focus on you know a specific part of the video. But any other things that you can add? Sorry about that, by the way. No, I, mean, I, can't, I can't think of anything. Man, I say we've covered. I say like the the, the the motorcycle thing is uh is like the motorcycle fight is why that uh, uh is why that chapter's time limits are quite a bit more difficult because you know, you've got like a, an extra fight that kind of adds a minute to your time. So it is a it's a tricky one to fit in, uh, but no, other yeah. than that, like, yeah, but it's a, it's a it's a tricky chapter. Like chapter four is always hard. It's always one of the hardest ones, you know. And it doesn't matter which version of Sigma you're playing or Ninja Gaiden Black. And I'm, I forget about Ninja Gaiden 2004, but I'm sure it's uh, it's pretty tough then because I think Black's time limits and kills were based on what Ninja Gaiden 04 was. So yeah, it's a. Uh, don't let this discourage you. And like I said, I think I went over on time the first time of it, or the you know the first time I went through and still got the Master Ninja ranking. But that's because I made the time limits and got UTs on all the other fights. So if you want to miss the time limits, you know make sure you're getting making the time limits and doing extra UTs. Because if you're missing time limits and extra UTs, and you miss the end of chapter you might not get that ranking. So, again, that's what we're focused on here. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. Well, I think that's it. Uh, Rachel's coming up next. And then another brutal time limit and kills for reuse. What we're used to reuse Chapter 5 in Ninja Gaiden Black. So, it might be a little bit before I can get to those. But hope you all enjoyed it. Again, questions or comments, please let us know. And you all take care, and we'll see you in the next video. Take care, everyone. Peace.